गुड आफ्टरनून मैम या प्लीज योर नेम माय नेम इज शुभम कुमार ओके शुभम इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ थैंक यू मैम फॉर गिविंग मी दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी टू इंट्रोड्यूस माय सेल्फ माय नेम इज शुभम कुमार आई हैव जस्ट कंप्लीटेड माय ग्रेजुएशन फ्रॉम मौलाना मजलूर यूनिवर्सिटी व्हिच इज लोकेटेड इन बिहार एंड आई हैव कंप्लीटेड माय इंटरमीडिएट डिग्री इन डॉक्टर जाकिर हुसैन हाई स्कूल प्लस 2 एंड आई हैव कंप्लीटेड माय मैट्रिकुलेशन फ्रॉम द डॉक्टर जाकिर हुसैन हाई स्कूल प्लस 2 and uh, my technical skills uh, are cobol jcl db2 vizan okay my short term goal is to complete my main frame degree in very efficient manner and my long term goal is to be in main frame sector until up to my life okay so your yeah, technical skills are uh, main frames right yes ma'am okay what is the difference between visa and uh, non visa okay ma'am in visa ma'am and non visa we can store the data permanently okay. and coming to the visa data Here, here it consists of ESDS, KSDS, RDS, and LDS. And okay. coming to the non-visa file, it consists of PS, PDS, and load library. And in visa data, we can delete the data, directly delete the data. But uh, coming to the non-visa, we can't uh, delete the data directly. But we can fill the data with spaces. And uh, we can't read the data directly. But uh, by using Ditto tool, we can read the data and fetch the data. But coming to the non-visa file, we can read the data directly. Okay. Kishubh, uh, what is file handling concept? Okay. There are five cases we can handle the file. First one is the file organization, file access mode, open the file, close the file, and file status code. Okay. Uh, will you explain anyone? Yeah, I'm sure. I want to explain file access mode. Okay. There are three ways we can access the file by using by using random file access mode we can fetch the data particular data directly. But by using sequential access mode we can read the all data line by line and by using dynamic we can read the particular block of records okay what is the life cycle of cobol life cycle of cobol there are some cases for life cycle of cobol first one is the declare the description of the file open the file process the file and close the file okay. how will you process the uh, file in cobol three cases we can process the file in cobol first one is the we can declare the file in environment division input output section file control area b and second is that we can declare the description the file in data division by using fd clause and uh, third one is that we can open the file process the file and uh, close the file in procedure division area b what are the access mode in cobol there are three access mode in cobol first one is the sequential second one is the random and third one is the dynamic sequential access mode we can fetch the data line by line and coming to the dynamic we can fetch the data or read the data block of the record and coming to the random we can fetch the data particularly okay shubham how to uh, insert the data in visa file can i write ma'am yeah okay okay thank you
Okay. Yes, ma'am. Completed. Okay. Can you explain that program? Yes, ma'am. Okay. In COBOL program, we can starting from the identification division. In after that, program ID with member name. Okay. In environment division, we can open the input output section and file control. We can write the select statement. Select a logical file assigned to physical file. Organization is index because we can write, we can insert the data in case DS. So index organization is index is mandatory. And access mode is sequential. And in case DS, we can mention one record key as a any record. So we can so I want to mention the record key as a EID. And after that, file status is FS. In what is EID? EID. Yes. EID is a record. We can uh, insert here any employee ID. Okay. And here, working through a section, we can write a variable for file storage record key. In data division, we can open the file section and we can write the, sorry, we can insert the all file record, EMP record. So we can, EID is a, EID picture class 905. Here we can mention the five picture class, any five memory assigned for the EID. And filler, filler takes one spaces. And EDM 915, we can insert a maximum 15 bytes for the enum and insert memory we can fill with filler. In procedure division, we can open the para, write the para, and the close the para. And we can access one by one over here. In open para, we can open the output file with output mode. And here the file open state is fs. We can successfully open the output file. We can so in our spool area fs equal to zero. Because zero is so the we can open the file successfully. And coming to the right para, we can accept here EID and ENAME. After the write EMP record, by using the write command, we can insert the data in our file. And after we can display here our FS code. FS code, we can check my record is insert, my data is inserted or not successfully. And after close para, we can here close the file, close EMP file, and display file close status FS. What is FS? FS is a file status code. Okay, Shivam, good. Uh, okay, we are done with this round. Okay, uh, we okay, will get back to you. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Yeah.